Welcome once again to Shelf Life Book Reviews Online, where I present to you a very highly recommended book. And the book today is definitely a very highly recommended. It's the Encyclopedia of Whales, Dolphins, and Porpoises, updated and revised by Eric Hoyt. This is published by Firefly Books, and it retails for $35, and that is a bargain. Uh, it is 300 pages of all things about mammals in the waters, dolphins, and the porpoises, and the whales. And uh, it is a whale of a great book, I will say that right now. The author, Eric Hoyt, has written, I think, close to 40 books about the sea. Uh, the last one that I read of his was, I think, called Strange Sea Creatures. And um, if you look, you will find the review. I think I reviewed it about a couple of years ago. But this book is just filled with so much information uh, about dolphins, whales, and porpoises. And we find out that the harpoon was invented in 1864 um, in Norway, and it has led to the slaughter of a lot of you know, whales. In fact, in the 20th century, 2.9 million whales were killed uh, in the waters, um, usually by the dreaded harpoon. And um, in, in fact, some species were actually quite close to, you know, to being extinct. Um, of, of course, people have tried to uh, save the whales started in the 1960s. And um, there are a lot of conservation companies, you know, um, PETA and uh, Greenpeace, and trying to save the mammals in the waters because they're ranks are being depleted rapidly. Um, I think I read that um, there are many endangered species now and some are on the verge of extinction, but this book still looks at the positives about all the different kinds. And we find out that the killer whale uh, has um, a, well, has calves, they're called, that's their offspring, uh, only once every five years. And we also find that the female um, stays with the mother um, for close to five years, but the male stays much longer, uh, 15 or more years. So uh, the male is more dependent on the mother than uh, uh, the female is, which is most fascinating. We also learn about the bowhead whale which is um, the longest living mammal in creation. Uh, the bowhead whale lives for an average of 110 to 130 years, if of course it has not been killed or has, you know, something else has happened to it. Uh, but some have been even uh, seen living 200 years. That is really amazing. Uh, and the author really gives us, you know, one fascinating bit of data after another. And what also sets this book apart are the amazing sea pictures as well too. I can't show you every single picture, but there are up close pictures of uh, the animals. The, you know, here's the beluga whale. And uh, it is just absolutely brimming with fascinating information about the whales. There's also a section at the back of the book where it profiles all 93, and there's 93 species, species, sorry, of whales, porpoises, and dolphins. And for each one, the author tells us its length, uh, its weight, its diet, its habitat, and whether it is on the, um, you know, conservation list of being endangered. And uh, this is really fascinating for young and old alike. If you have children uh, who are interested in creatures of the sea, uh, this book is definitely one that you cannot go wrong with. It is a book that you will look back at many, many times because every page is just filled with so much data. Eric Hoyt has done an amazing job, as he always does when he does these sea books. Uh, he, he goes that extra mile to give us information that we find in, 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 well informative, riveting, and uh, definitely something that we will not forget. And so, like I say, if you're looking for a really great book, this encyclopedia, this is the updated and revised one. I know there have been a couple of editions before it, but this 
well, the best has even gotten better because this is definitely a book that you will cannot go wrong with and you will love to add this to your collection. So um, if you do purchase it, please let me know if you do agree with my review. I think you will. So until we meet again, stay safe, stay sane, stay in touch, and I will see you at the bookstore. Bye for now. See you real soon with another review.